Hi everybody, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm gonna to tell you the story about a lovely bride that we had the pleasure of working with. Just under a year ago, in April of 2019, we received an email from a lovely woman in Nigeria named Anita. She was in search of a designer to create her dream wedding gown for her March 2020 wedding to actor Emmanuel Ikuvese. Anita had enlisted the help of her cousin Ade, who lives in Ottawa, to help with the search for the right designer. Turns out Ade had made a few phone calls and one of those calls was to Kleinfeld Canada, right here in Toronto. Ade mentioned to them that her cousin was looking for a designer to create a custom wedding gown and Kleinfeld made the recommendation for them to reach out directly to us. And we're glad they did. Anita told us her story and described the vision she saw for herself and the wow factor statement that she wanted to make on her big day. After receiving Anita's inspiration picture, we set up an initial FaceTime call to get to know each other and I knew instantly that we had to make this dress happen for her. We sent over several design options via email and went back and forth a little bit until we landed on a design that she loved. Being based in Toronto and creating gowns for brides all around the world has always been such a fun process for us. With technology today and a little bit of coordination, we are able to schedule FaceTime and Skype consultations no matter what time zone a client is in. Because of Anita's busy schedule, she was unable to come to Canada for us to take her measurements. So with the help of another good friend, we scheduled yet another FaceTime call and her friend took live measurements as we directed her and told her exactly what to do. Anita wanted a two-piece dress, a separate bodice and a separate skirt. The bodice was made from a Mikado fabric imported from Spain and it was hand draped onto a fabric shell made to Anita's proportions. We really wanted to create sculptural elements to help achieve that wow factor. The romantic full skirt consisted of many layers of tulle and required several pairs of hands to lay it out and cut it to ensure that all the layers were cut identically and equally. Process, Anita was not able to see her dress in person. So she put her trust in us and we did our best to bring her vision to life. We would schedule check-in FaceTime calls to touch base and show progress of the dress. And the reaction the first time Anita saw it was priceless. I'm gonna do, I'm gonna do a reveal, hold on, hold on. Oh my God! Okay, get ready. I hope you can see this a lot. This is what? We were making great progress, and most importantly, our bride was happy. With minor tweaks to some details here and there, we continued working on the dress.
Oftentimes, the finishing details of garments made from delicate fabric can be tedious and time consuming. We always work very hard to produce our best work because at the end of the day, when our bride is happy, then we are happy. particular took several hours to level because we had to line up every layer of tulle and cut them together to ensure that one layer was not longer or shorter than the rest. Their big event took place last weekend, and let me tell you, it was a grand affair. Congratulations to the happy couple. We wish you so much love and all the best. If you enjoyed this video and have enjoyed my content thus far, please leave a thumbs up, share, and don't forget to subscribe. Thanks so much, and I'll see you in the next video.